Now, high definition from the station on your side. This is Wavy News Online. Hey everyone, it is Sunday, May 15th. Thanks for logging on to wavy.com. I'm Katie Collette. And I'm David Culver. In the news this morning, crews will once again would continue their search for a missing boater. The 24-year-old disappeared after a sailboat overturned in the James River around midnight Friday. Ten friends left a party late Thursday night and boarded the 22-foot sailboat. Somehow, the vessel capsized. Five people swam several miles to shore. Crews rescued four others from the water, but one young man is still missing. Officials say they will not release his name until they're able to find him. While the cause of the accident is under investigation, officials say the boat may have been overloaded. There is one factor about this that seems increasingly clear has been a contributing factor, and that was that there were 10 people aboard a very small sailboat. 23-year-old Tyler Lorenzi died after he was pulled from the river. He was an aerospace engineer at NASA's Research Center at Langley. Today, search teams plan to use an airplane to get a better view of the river. Portsmouth Police need your help this morning finding the person who pulled the trigger in a deadly shooting. That's right. It happened just before midnight Saturday on Mount Vernon Avenue near the London Oak Apartments. When police got there, they found a woman dead from a gunshot wound in her car. Right now, police are working to determine a motive. No word on any arrest. If you have information, you're asked to call Crime Line. That number, of course, 1-888-LOCK-YOU-UP. Amazing air power is flying in the skies above Hampton Roads. You can see antique aircraft and modern flyers are on display this weekend at the Air Power Over Hampton Roads Air Show. It's all happening this weekend at Langley Air Force Base in Hampton. Folks are getting an up-close look at planes and jets all the while enjoying the high flying action. Then your side got up with people Saturday and asked them what they love most about the experience. Enjoying the wonderful weather and taking advantage of an air show here. Uh, just once a year opportunity to come out and watch history in motion and be patriotic. And this helps to connect the military installation with the community that surrounds it. It gives the community an opportunity to see what the military does. Nice and loud there. The Langley Air Show runs through today. It is free. Gates open at 9 a.m. Wavy TV 10 and Fox 43 personalities will be there once again today signing autographs. Now, in high definition, your Super Doppler 10 forecast with meteorologist Sergey Galindo. And if you plan on heading out to uh, the air power over Hampton Roads, it's not looking too bad. The morning hours were staying dry. Could see an isolated shower or two in the morning hours, but nothing widespread. I think we get a little bit more widespread activity as we head after the noon hour. So in the afternoon and evening hours, we'll see a good chance for scattered showers and storms. Temperature-wise, upper 70s to low 80s again for today. And I think after 7 o'clock tonight, things begin to wind down. Upper 70s for tomorrow, 20% chance for showers and storms, but better chances to Tuesday into Wednesday. Back to you. Okay, thank you. And thank you, everyone, for joining Wavy News Online. I'm Katie Collette. And I'm David Culver. Have a great day, everyone. Now, high definition from the station on your side. This is Wavy News Online.